Doctor, my asthma is getting worse and I'm not sure why it's happening. What are the kind of things you think about if you get a scenario like this in your medical exams? Of course, you've got to work out a few key things. Is it acutely getting worse or chronically getting worse? But say someone comes in with a three month history of generally worsening symptoms, what are the kind of things that you think about? Of course, you've got to think medicine first. So red flags, you can't afford to miss things like cough and, and fever and hemoptysis and weight loss and, and recent travel and night sweats. Of course, it could be something much bigger than the asthma going on. But say you've ruled out all of those kind of things. Think about infections in general. Mr. X, sometimes when people get coughs and colds and little bugs, it can flare up their asthma. Have you had anything like that recently? Is that something that you've noticed? Maybe that's the whole reason behind all of this. The weather in general, Mr. X, sometimes we know that certain changes in weather can lead to asthma symptoms, particularly when it gets colder, for example, or there's some humidity in the air. Can I check normally, does it happen at the same time of year in other years? Maybe that's a routine, regular type of trigger for this person. Pets, Mrs. X, we know that certain pets can trigger our symptoms, so new cats, new dogs. Have you had anything new come in the house recently? Have you had or moved to a place where there are lots of pets around worth thinking about this kind of thing? Allergens, you know, things like pollen, for example, or certain food allergens can trigger off asthma sometimes. Again, worth asking about recent changes to exposure. Exercise, of course, Mrs. X, we do know that when sometimes people do a lot of exercise, it can trigger off symptoms like the ones you're describing. Can I check if you've started any new hobbies or new activities or new sports? Or if you've always played sport, have you changed the level of sport that you're playing? Again, thinking about those key triggers might be useful. The job, obviously a big part in a lot of medical conditions, but you know, linking it to that problem, Mr. X, certainly sometimes things that we do in our working life can trigger off symptoms like asthma, you know, asking about dusty environments, asking about you know, using paints, for example, asking about certain chemical exposures, worth thinking about the job. Habits in general, you know, John, we do know that certainly things like smoking or inhaling certain drugs can make asthma symptoms worse. Can I just check if you do any of those things or have levels changed recently? Pollution in general, you know, again, Mrs. X, we know that sometimes when there's a lot of um, pollution in the atmosphere, if you're living in environments where there's lots of pollution, people's asthma can flare up. Can I check if you've moved house recently or has your environment changed? Maybe that's the key trigger. Medications, of course, you may be looking at the medication record, looking for things like beta blockers, but asking about over-the-counter things. Mr. X, sometimes certain medications that are used for pain, you're thinking non steroidals can lead to things like asthma symptoms. Can I check that you've not bought anything new over-the-counter recently? And of course, things in the house itself, like things like house dust mite or you know new carpets, for example. Think about the environment that they live in. Again, there may be certain triggers going on there. So a huge range of things that you may think about if someone comes in with worsening symptoms in your role play scenario. Lots more than this, of course, but this will give you a good base. Much more like this on our webinars, our courses, and our audiobooks. Hashtag can pass, will pass. Hashtag I went with Aurora.